Yo, yo, what's up? Melanie Winston here. Welcome to the Passion Pursuers Network. What's up, my Passion Pursuers? Hey, look, listen, if this is your first time over here at the Passion Pursuers Network, welcome. We have nothing but positive vibes over here, motivational vibes, business tips, tips to enhance your life, just like vibes. We vibe over here, right? So welcome. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button so you can be a part of the family, right? You're a passion pursuer. You're here for a reason. And hit that notification, the bell. I'm sorry, the bell button. Hit that so you'll get notifications whenever I upload these videos for you, right? So happy Monday. If you're watching this and it's not a Monday, it's because it's not Monday. And I recorded this on Monday. So happy Monday to my passion pursuers. Hey, look, listen real quick. I want to talk to you today about change, right? I want to talk to you about change. I want to talk to you about change. I want to talk to you about change. Change is not something that is easy it's not something that comes overnight if you've been uh rocking with this channel for a minute you can see i've dropped some weight right like if you go back to my earlier videos you see when i would just be coming in the house from working out and i went through this cycle for years right i would get motivated work out for a couple months and then slack back off get motivated work out for a couple months get some results take some pictures flexing and fall back off and gain the weight right back right so i was thinking like i stepped on the scale and i was 268 pounds and i was like no this cannot be life like this is not me it can't be life i used to play basketball very athletic i love being out and about moving around shaking around doing things right and 268 that's a lot of weight to carry on somebody i'm 5'10 so 268 5'10 i was like something has got to change um, didn't know what that change was going to be started educating myself right changing growing putting knowledge into my brain and applying that knowledge right started watching, watching some documentaries and I wound up cutting out um, like red meat chicken anything that wasn't seafood and so I ate and I did that for about eight months maybe and then I wound up cutting the seafood out so I don't eat any meat right and I'm very close to being vegan I had to change I had to change was it something that was I won't say it was really difficult because literally watching the few documentaries that I watched I'll go ahead and tell you what they were what the health cowspiracy and uh, fat sick and nearly dead too I had already saw fat sick and nearly dead one but just watching those three documentaries that one day literally the next morning I woke up and I was like that's it I can't do, I can't do meat anymore um, because I learned what was really going on out here with the meat so stop eating meat so that was a change for me right and when you change it's not going to feel comfortable people around you may not understand it my family still to this day they don't understand how i don't eat meat right they tell me i don't get enough protein they tell me i'm not healthy they all types of crazy stuff sometimes but at the end of the day i had to change in order to get the results that i wanted so for you what i'm going to challenge you to do is i don't know what your results are what you're trying to achieve whatever it is what you're passionate about you're going to have to Educate yourself, number one, in order to change. Pick up some books. Um, get you accountability partner. Link up with some people who are maybe not going in the same exact direction as you, but who are um, entrepreneurs or who are uh, into fitness, whatever it is that you may be, right? Get yourself involved with that circle and, and see what it is they got going on. I know myself, I have a circle of people that I'm with and we're actually right now in a 75 day blitz challenge. Not something that I've been talking about a lot on social media, but we're on like uh, day 29. Today is day 29. I haven't been to sleep yet, but it's Monday, so it's day 29. And simply just reading 30, min 30 minutes a day. So here's a book that I'm currently reading, one of the books that I'm reading. The Magic of Thinking Big, and uh, me and my wife are actually reading this book, and this book is, it really is, is mind-blowing, some of the things that are, the, some of the nuggets that are in this book, and actually I'm going to wind up doing a book review on this book to let you know some of the important gems that I got this book once I finish reading it. And another book that I'm reading here, The Mastery of Love, right? The Mastery of Love, it's a wisdom book by Don Miguel Ruiz. This is a really good book. And something else that I'm reading during my 30 day blitz challenge, but it's helping me like to understand some things, some, some questions that I've been having. Um, one of the answers to is helping me to understand that. So again, changing, doing things differently. I will read a book, say I'm reading a book. I will read two or three pages, two or three chapters maybe and be done with the book and wouldn't complete the book, but I want to be better. I'm going to be, I'm growing, right? I'm really growing. I'm actually growing. I'm learning. I'm applying knowledge and I, it's like I want more information. I want more knowledge. So 
consistently reading those books, change, going through the books and completing them and actually applying what I'm learning. People like to say, oh, knowledge is power, but I like to take it a step further and say the application of knowledge is power. So we're going to reel it back in because I can go on and on when it comes to this type of stuff. But I just want you to know that if you want something different, you have to be willing to change. If you are out here trying to grow a business and you've been trying to grow that business for some time and you're not getting the results that you want, change up your, change up what you're doing, whether it's your marketing strategy or whether it's uh, your networking opportunities like whatever who your audience that you have your product in front of whatever it is that you're doing change it do something different and if you don't know what the different you can do youtube university go up here youtube university how do i grow my business how do i use social media to grow my business just start looking for some things and you'll start getting some answers and maybe you're not into business maybe you are into fitness right so maybe you were like me and you would Pick it up and put it down. Pick it up and put it down. Be consistent, right? Change something. Change your diet. I can tell you diet is the most important thing. I don't, I still, I'm just getting back into the gym. Actually, I'm just starting to do resistance because I'm ready to start toning up. But I can't say that a lot of my weight loss is attributed to me working out. It's all because I changed the way I was eating. So again, change. Change may not be comfortable. Change is very important and vital in order for you to grow, in order for you to get to the next level that you're trying to achieve. So whatever that thing is for you, my friend, I want you to go out here and just make some changes today, starting today, not tomorrow. Today, do one thing different in the pursuit of your goals. Just one thing different, right? Just do one thing different. And do that thing consistently and see how it affects whatever it is that you're doing, right? See what changes come about. You will never be able to change. Things will never be able to change. You will never be able to elevate or go to another level without first changing. Changing your mind, changing your, your spirit, just, just changing from within. Changing how you think about yourself. Changing how you think about life. Changing how you think about abundance and, and how worthy you are. Just changing, doing some changes within. Change within, go deep within, right? Go deep within, change within. And your outer world will begin to reflect that, right? So I hope you found some value here. Again, if you haven't already, go ahead and subscribe to the channel. If you did find value, go ahead and share this out for me, right? Because I want to get my message out to whoever this message is for. It could be for thousands of people, right? And in order for me to get it out to the thousands of people, I need my lovely supporters to go ahead and share this for me. Comment down below. Let me know what you're, uh, what you're going to commit to changing, right? Let me know what you're working on. Uh, let me know some video ideas that you may have. Ask me some questions, but just let me know that you are going to commit to change if you don't do anything else. Again, peace, love, light. We on go. 2019 is your year. Take your action. Change. Let's get it.